Hey, what's going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today, we're going to check it out how to fuse two different type of logos together and see if we can create something new in mid journey. So I'm going to start from the very top. And of course, it started from the Superman Batman combination. And here I try to combine separately the Superman logo with the Batman logo. Here you can see the prompt. It's a simple prompt. Combine Superman logo with Batman logo. I had better success combining the Superman character with the Batman character. Then I tried combine Chanel logo with McDonald's logo. So check this out. We got the second option. It's in the style of McDonald's and it uses the double C letters from Chanel and it is actually accurate. I mean, it did what I asked for. And now I switched it here, McDonald's logo in Chanel style. You got like the fourth option, which is kind of accurate. It looks pretty luxurious. Or you got the first option, which is also kind of luxurious. So it really transformed that the letter M that before looked, you know, modern and playful into something more classic and luxurious. So it kind of got the memo. So we got here McDonald's logo as a luxurious brand. We got like the third option, which is pretty good. You know, it's like McDonald's logo upgraded and transformed into something more funky. And then we got another one. Let's see. Not that bad. Again, like you can see in the fourth example, it uses these uh, curvy letter M's to form something really luxurious. So it kind of gets it, not 100%, but uh, these are ideas that eventually can you can like recreate in Adobe Illustrator. We got some more McDonald's logo made in the style of Chanel logo. I tried to combine prompts, but uh, mainly you get the same results. But the fourth is great. It also has the red color. It also has like this gold color instead of uh, the yellow. And the letter M also matches the McDonald's logo. So it's good. Check this out. I also tried the NBC logo as McDonald's logo. So NBC logo, you can see the colorful bird. Basically, it incorporated those colors in the letter M and it formed this really cool a rainbow letter M. So check this out. If you choose something more symmetrical, the AI won't have that much problem, you know, converting those together or fusing them or doing, you know, customizing them because they're like symmetric and it's just a more easier job for the AI because the whole thing is reflected. So anyways, this was also a symmetric mark combined the Mercedes logo with the Mazda logo. Check this out. The first option came out pretty good. You still can see the Mercedes uh, star in there. And this could be like from the letter M from the Ma Ma Mazda Mazda. I don't know how it's pronounced. But anyways, it looks um, like a fork. Combine the Mercedes logo with the Mazda logo again. Check this out. The third option looks incredible, but none of them are, you know, logos. I mean, but anyways, check this out. It's pretty wild. So these could be like some of ideas, you know, you, can, you take the star and you make like these kind of blades out of it, but they're kind of basic, you know, they're pretty, pretty basic. And then we got combined the Volkswagen logo with the letter M. And in the fourth example, it really did it. You know, these are kind of basic. I did this like 10 years ago when I was like a really beginner, but you know, it worked. And we got to combine the Volkswagen logo with a star symbol. And well, it didn't do a pretty good job, but look at that in the fourth, fourth example, it decorated with these spikes and it looks pretty cool actually. Oh, look at that Volkswagen logo in Western style. And it tried to make a badge out of it. So I tried to emphasize it. So we got like Volkswagen logo, vintage badge. And you know, it just decorated, not a big deal, but it still did a pretty nice job. We got the McDonald's logo, vintage style, pretty decent, pretty decent. And I did a couple of versions. The McDonald's logo response really good for the vintage combination. And we got combined Gucci logo with Volkswagen logo. Unfortunately, it didn't want to combine the logo, but it combined the Volkswagen van. I think this is the T2 van with uh, the Gucci colors and team style. And you, you also have like the Italian flag colors, something in that nature. Check this out. Like we got mix of the Volkswagen logo with the Gucci logo. Uh, again, same thing. We got the Italian flag and we got the Gucci colors in the van. So yeah, this is what I did with this experiment. It, it was a lot of fun and uh, I'm planning to do some more to, you know, explore the parameters and see if this AI actually can do something good. So yeah, mainly this was it. Thanks for watching.